Wow, what a wonderful day in Shinobi Striker. You gotta be kidding me. What's going on guys? Wait, whoa, whoa, where are you going? We got a video to do, bro. Don't look at the chicken. So as I was saying, bro, I'm gonna make you into a Chick-fil-A sandwich. Get out of the way. <laughs> hey, look at me. Look at me. The video today is going to be a b -b 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 banger. Now we're gonna be messing with snakes. If you have fear of snakes, I get out of here. Hey, like we have a video to record, so can you not hide behind trees? I'm scared of snakes, dude. I have the weakest CAC. Anyways, let's get into the build. The first user is gonna be Shadow Snake, which allows you to do poison damage, which is damage over time, and allows you to stop their recovery over time, or at least slow it down. The next jutsu is Amaterasu, which is a burn over time jutsu that also gets rid of super armor. Next up, we'll be using the Kevin Durant clone, which also poisons people and allows you to sub is the 30 second cooldown. The ninja tool has to be Crimson Star, which allows you to keep your opponent in place and do multiple hits. But this Crimson Star is blockable and it does have a short range. Next up, we have Summoning Jutsu Reanimation, which is from the Orochimaru DLC that does basically just a wave of the two Hokages. I'm fallen and I can't get up. Sing, sing, sing. <laughs> You cannot run from your destiny, my son. Why are you running? Come back here. Whoa, whoa, chill, bro. Oh, whoa, that's a lot of fire bending right there, my guy. Oh, now you're an airbender? Pick a hey, struggle, big homie. Look at you in first place, so inspirational, dying at the hands of somebody in second place. Oh, I got an assist for that? So we just out here stealing kills. Okay, pet. So my Gatorade sign is blinking, but you know I don't give up, guys. You know I bob and weave and I do tactical retreats. Watch this. If this happened to you, what would you do in Shinobi Striker? You're fighting the guy, you're extra aggressive, and then he just kills you. The next part of the video is sponsored by Stanley Steamer. By the way, I steamrolled in this 1v1 100% joking but without SS Jones this video would not have been possible all his links are going to be down in the description so make sure you do watch his channel and look at his stream they're always pretty fire hey he showed off the awesome knuckle knife combo that I taught him hey HD the sensei in range versus range it's always about who can do the better combo and look combo god HD is doing God's work there goes the Amaterasu and the shadow snake and hey you know I'm gonna throw that crimson star and it's a GG I'll tell you right now, if you're not very skilled in Shinobi Striker, I recommend that you don't use Shadow Snake because simply it's not that good of a jutsu. It does take a bit of skill to figure out what to do with it. I think a Hidden Rose or a Zula are about the only ones that can make every jutsu in Shinobi Striker halfway decent, and I am not one of those people. I had to really try. Once in a blue moon, I find someone or find something that makes me have to try a little bit harder, and this 1v1 put me on the brink due to the fact SS Jones has gotten so much better from our 1v1. Now listen, SS Jones is no slouch, you know what I'm saying? But hey, I had to turn up for the one time. He's using the Kimba Swords. I felt a little bit disrespected by that, so I'm gonna turn up real quick. And he's using the stupid little Baka Jutsu. Takes a hit, he's dead. But am I gonna get the kill? Hey, hey, poison out, yes sir. This is a sub-suggested build. Now, if you have a build to suggest, comment down below and I'll try it out. POV, you got smacked with a bunch of snakes in the face. What do you think that means for you? POV, you're about to get smacked upside the head, SS Jones. Who am I to tell you, GG? Look at my snake clone doing God's work. Yes sir, that's a double burn and poison, man. You gotta fight back, combo lock, got it. You missed it, HD, come on, bro. We gotta work on them combos, man. We gotta get back in the lab. Oh, he's using awesome and knuckle knives. This man toxic, man. Oh, oh, oh. It's a slight work. Oh, no, SS Jones. It looks like you might die here, big bro. GG. These Buddha hands ain't gonna work, big bro. Uh-uh. No, sir. Dog, Itachi, dude. Square stun into Amaterasu is like a crambule. It just worked, and it tastes so good to see them die. Whoa, whoa, whoa. HD, chill out, man. What, what are you on today, man? Chill. I thought SS Jones was a homie. Not today. We in the pit. It's only sweats in the pit. Let's go, SS Jones. 
Stone, what you got for me? Yeah, that Kerma Impact missed. Let me go ahead and hit you with these Shadow Snakes. <laughs> Bye, have a wonderful time. Summoning Jutsu, reanimation, and a square stand up. Oh, say live. For the people who got this far in the video, I'm gonna go ahead and give you the clothes that I wore on this build. Top skill is all geared up, which boosts ninja tool damage. Next, we gotta boost your max health to keep you in the fight. For accessory skill, we have one in a million. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.